Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful viewers. How are you all doing today? I welcome you all to your channel. This is your host Shivansh. Those who are new to my channel, thank you so very much for tuning in. You know, today I thought like, okay, let me put lipstick and do something. <laughs> all right. Okay, I have already shuffled the deck. That's how I have been divinely guided that I'll be pulling up cards uh, randomly. All right. Okay. First of all, what I feel is that, uh, believe me or not, when I cut the decks and I was pulling up the deck uh, from the box, the cards that I came across was three of swords, seven of swords, you know, uh, devil. All right. These are so low frequency energy, right? So some of you are dealing with this energy a big time okay like it's kind of a purging that is taking place in your life and you are experiencing something very soulful very spiritual all right and this triggering or tower experience that you are going through right now all right it is helping you see who you are as a soul and what are your soul essence your spirit essence all right You are a group of people who are looking for uh, approval from others and the fa and, and, and our Father in Heaven is asking you that there is nobody in this universe, my dear, who can approve you, alright, except for your Father in Heaven. And your Father has already approved of you and that's why you have a smartphone today and you are listening to this message. Everybody is not lucky, right? So that's what your father is asking you to see. That's your spirit essence. That's why he has, you know, he has given you that understanding. Go and watch this video so that you get this message. All right. Because you, this is your soul food. All right. So the tower, the three of swords or seven of swords, because see, three of swords and seven of swords energy is something it brings tower with it. All right. So. It's rude awakening. You feel hurt. Somebody ditched you. Devil energy. Oh, I saw this card. I told you, right? So you are going through a death and rebirth uh, process right now. All right. Rebirth process. And every time there is this triggering uh, in it, within you that, take, that makes you really, that takes you by surprise, that gives you shock. All right. I can hear so much of noise. That's the kind of commotion that you are having within you, my dear. All right. As if like you can hear people coming from different dimensions, different directions and howling at you, shouting at you. It may not be happening in literal terms, but within you, it is like this. You might feel that people are shouting at me, you know, screaming at me, you know, everybody. You will, I am feeling like this. You are looking at others as really evil it is your own dark energy projection that is taking place within you that's why you are seeing everybody as like nobody understands me everybody is so bad you know people inflict pain onto me people don't understand me yeah, some, this is a message for only those group of people who are in a complaining energy and you know who you are you cannot run away from this truth no matter how much you say that no i'm not like that if you, even if you are coming into that energy of saying that, no, I'm not like that, and then trust me, you are actually like that. If you would not have been in that energy, this even sentence would not have come that I am not in that, all right? This message would have been just an uh, uh, you know ordinary message and you will be like waiting to hear if something resonates with you or not. You just know who you are in what energy you are vibrating so i'm telling you somebody has done wrong to you in the past has given you that three of swords energy all right has shown you that devil energy and now you are going through that identity crisis of like nobody is like this nobody loves me nobody this nobody understands me and you know as if like you're looking for some kind of an approval and you see the first card come out here is that you know uh, and second card like you know love in spite of all of it all there isn't a soul on the planet who doesn't crave your approval all right are you kidding me what I'm saying try to see everything from that perspective of unconditional love because 
uh, whatever is happening around you it is happening by the will of the divine to help you see help you grow help you evolve all right so irrespective of what these people are doing around you love them it is tough love them all right because they also need that love and craving the way you do all right the way you are looking for an approval so do everybody you know that the people like you like them love them understand them it is everybody's wish everybody's dream you see so you have to understand that and hence you know take everybody as a as a teammate of yours and go with that all right if you're mom shouts at you just give her a hug you know mom come on chill like that don't go back and start confronting you know no you are wrong you are right. how does it matter my dear so i'm just giving you a hypothetical example all right it may happen with anybody it may be it may happen with probably the love interest of your life your kids your neighbors your colleague you know learn to let go my dear show love vibrate in that love energy and that is the only and only option you have left out my dear to come out of those toxic devilish energy shadowy energy all right triggering and traumatic energies of those people de deceit you disrespected you demeaned you blamed you uh, you know uh, kind of spit it on you it's like this has used you abused you mentally physically emotionally and gave given you those three of uh, sorts kind of energy all right that's the reason you have been struggling so much to come out and your seventh chakra is absolutely on point right now some of you are turning 41 seven plays a significant role in your life in some way shape or form all right and your intuition is on point my dear listen to your intuition your father is saying all right listen to your intuition your intuition is loud and clear speaking to you all right and you have asked a question to your father in heaven about when love will enter your life and i can see love is about to enter your life on the sixth month with the card number 33 door to romance all right if you guys are in separation for a long no commitment look at this right under that that card is this broken heart and i have been talking about three of swords right you all are in this energy and universe is actually stitching, stitching your heart wounding uh, you know healing the wounds of your heart uh, so that he he can make this broken heart into this heart all right where the, the key can enter and open that and i'm feeling that as uh, 3 3 is uh, number six so we are heading towards month of june so in the month of june love may enter your life and this the moment this love will enter your life your life will be completely healed and and you will be tapping into this energy of sun my dear you are heading towards uh, you are turning out to be that love and light not only for yourself and for others if you will end up seeing a 3333 three, three, then take it as a confirmation all right uh, some of you are having fear of speaking you are going to get the courage to speak now all right speak with dignity speak with uh, authenticity speak with truthfulness not fear of uh, not fear of what if and not and buts and what not all right and no insecurities no doubts no fear it is just that this is how i need to be this is who i am i need to be truthful i need to be authentic and this is how i need to be so you are going to speak now nine of wands you are dead and tired that's what i am telling you with the ten of wands come on i'm just cutting the decks nine of wands ten of wands three of swords seven of swords devil um then broken heart are you getting me the energy that you are in that's what i'm saying all right you have to find that beauty within you my dear all right find that beauty within you stand your ground you know let be less emotional all right be logical sometimes all right be fair-minded all right don't look for approval from here and there okay be the sun all right be the sun so the people follows you and loves you okay don't go to door to door to look for approval all come and love me all right otherwise you are going to be in this energy look at the energies you know nine of wands and five of wands ten of wands 
all right you are your your soul is tired all right your soul is tired hence you are also feeling tired all right these days you are not in peace i saw 1001 all right these days you are really not in peace because of this energy this is what i have been telling you when i cut took out the card that, uh, from the box i saw this card i shuffled and stopped here itself again devil all right you may be dealing with a capricorn or has a very strong placement of capricorn in your natal chart all right or aries or you are dealing with an aries all right universe is giving you those triggering and tower moment only to help you see see i told you remember use logic and structure to increase your success all right wherever you are stuck bitter or sore whatever energy you are vibrating sometimes i told you already stop being too emotional all right be logical be fair-minded use your logic to restructure your life so that nobody comes and leaves you in the four of cups energy all right you know universe is pleading you your inner child is pleading you please hear me all right i'm not liking to where you are you know i really want to go this side can you please take me this side so 11 11 11 this is a really a prayer from your spirit i can connect to your spirit and your spirit is asking me to tell you that all right i am not liking you know to be here please free me from this cage all right i want to fly in the mighty sky all right really i am looking for that healing i know my powers hear me out please your soul is speaking to you like that all right because your soul does not need any approval my dear because it is already uh, um, the energy of the source all right it is it understands only love giving kindness compassion then from where you are vibrating in this energy of three of swords seven of swords devil energy from where these shadowy energies are coming ask yourself so listen to your intuition do meditation all right and come in your uh, power you know at this hour to take charge of your life and speak your truth stand your truth and keep going ahead in this adverse situation as also if nothing is happening in your life that you are liking then do something to change it then rather than choosing to stay in that energy for the rest of your life all right so I hope this messages has helped you in some way, shape or form. Until we meet again, I'm sending across much love and light to you all. Om Namah Shivaya. Stay blessed and in peace. Bye-bye.